okay guys so in this video we will see how we can connect physical access point to our virtual topology as we know this is our topology and we already install wireless LAN controller okay and we can access this wireless LAN controller okay because it's a virtual we install them and we can access this wireless LAN controller but the reason is in our topology we need access point and access point is not possible virtually in EVE but we can connect physical access point to our topology so the one I'm using is this model you can easily buy this one on eBay Amazon and maybe a local market uh, it's around I bought on eBay I believe a 15 US dollar so if you type eBay so it will take you to the eBay and from there you can buy on 15 US dollar okay done so this is the one which I'm using I will show you through a uh, camera as well okay uh, this the model is written here you can buy any model any used one for your lab purpose okay on the back side of this access point there is a mode button this mode button is used for many purpose even you can reset this access point to the factory reset there is a console if you want to take console like a router and switch and if you want a command line interface there is ethernet to connect to the PV, poe switch a uh, power over ethernet but in my case my modem is not poe power over ethernet so i will use 48 dc power injector either power adapter so you need to buy separately power adapter as well 48 dc okay so this is the screenshot which i bought on 15 us dollar from ebay or amazon and maybe you could find a local market okay so this the connectivity how I connect this access point to uh, my virtual lab what I done my physical server HP server the first interface I use you can use any interface I connected to my wireless modem first interface any interface you can use so I plug this one here the second one I plug to my access point here and also I plug the power adapter because this modem is not power over Ethernet we call them a uh, modem you know the modem which install in our home which provide wireless and wire connectivity okay so I connect like this way this the connectivity and also I take a console as well okay we can take console as well so it's in the same range because this modem provide 192 168 100 range so this server is already in the 100 range if we go to my server on my server I install ESXi okay VMware and I, inst uh, I assign this IP 192.168.100.100 also i install eve on the same and eve is also connected to my modem this one and eve ip is 192.168.100.20 and the same range my wireless lan controller is also 192.168.100.240 okay so the same range i connected to this access point as well so it will take 192.168.100 range okay so this is the connectivity which I done my physical server is also uh, directly connected to my Wi-Fi modem which I show you and my physical uh, modem IP is 192.168.100 by default is 100.1 and other country it can be 1.1 it can be 2.1 whatever but in Saudi Arabia is 100.1 that's my modem let me show you the uh, back side of my this access point let me on the camera of my mobile phone and I can show you here and let me go to my mobile so you see this the let me zoom it this the console I connected console cable and the other side I connected to my 
laptop. A second port I connected to the uh, modem. So this the uh, cable which I connected to my physical modem. And the last cable is this one is power adapter. As I told you, uh, my Wi-Fi uh, these are not uh, power over Ethernet. Otherwise, in real life, it doesn't require uh, uh, this power injector. Okay, so this the access point uh, you can see, and I take console as well. This the mode button if you want to reset, and this the console if you want to take console. This the Ethernet connected to or Wi-Fi modem, and this one. Okay. And this way, this is the connectivity of this access point, okay? And we can use this access point to in our virtual lab, just like it means it's connected somewhere here, okay? So this is the way, okay? In the next video, we will see how we can configure it.